everyone, and welcome back to Magic the Gathering Revival. We are still cracking our Guild the Ravnica box number two here. We are going to get into our middle stack. Last time, our lucky stack, I feel, was our middle stack. And again, this box comes from Golden Eagle Comics and Games in Reading, PA. They've been around for 20 plus years, still running strong. Check them out at their website, www.goldeneaglecomics.com. All right. Let's get into our middle stack and see if we can have some luck like last time. Pack number one. Here we go. We already got a foil rare, and we are at one mythic. We pulled a pelt collector, and we got an arc light mythic as well. All right. We have a Golgari Raiders. Sinister Sabotage. Sun Home Stalwart. And our rare is a Light of the Legion. Four and two white for a 5-5 five, five flyer with Mentor. When Light of the Legion dies, put a plus one plus one counter on each white creature you control. And we got an Is It Guildgate and an Elf Knight token. Hopefully we don't go crazy with the tokens this time. I think we have enough soldier tokens forever. <laughs> I don't think we need any more. All right. Pack number two. We have a Beam Splitter Mage. Price of Fame. Rampaging Monument. And our rare is an Assassin's Trophy. Yeah, all right. We got ourselves another Assassin's Trophy. Fantastic pull. We're going to stick that guy right there in the middle. We have a Golgari Guildgate. And an insect token. All right, the tokens are switching up. I don't know if you guys caught the last video, but I, out of 12 packs, there was 11 soldier tokens. So that's what I'm talking about when I say about the tokens here. All right. We got ourselves an Assassin's Trophy. Fantastic pull. Hopefully the middle stack keeps it coming. We have a Join Shields. Status and Statue. Selective Snare. And we have a Mythic. Chance for Glory. Creatures you control gain indestructible. Take an extra turn after this one. At the beginning of that turn's end step, you lose the game. One, one red and one white to cast. Our second Mythic. All right. We have an Is It Guildgate and a Bird Illusion. So our middle stack is looking pretty good, just like the last box, guys. I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna keep it going and see. I, I might, I, depending on how well we do here in this box, I might have to grab another box maybe, and we'll have to check that middle stack out and test our luck with the middle stack, cause. Like I said, our middle stack on the last box was fantastic, and this one's raring up to be a good one, too. All right, we have Ledev Champion. Lotleth Giant. Golgari Finebroker. And our rare is a Runaway Steamkin. Okay, not too bad. It's our second one of those. We have a Demir Guildgate and a Bird Illusion. All right, let's keep it going, guys. So we're at two Mythics. We got an Assassin's Trophy as well. What else can we find? Oh, and we also pulled a Foil Pelt Collector in the last video. See if we can't get a second Foil Rare maybe in this box. That would be great. All right. We have an Invert and Invent. Disinformation Campaign. Inescapable Blaze. And our rare is a Dawn of Hope. 
one and one white whenever you gain life. You may pay two if you do draw a card. And you can pay three and one white. Create a one one white soldier creature token with lifelink. And a Boros Guild Gate and an Elf Knight token. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. We have seven more packs to go. Still room for some spicy pulls. That is for sure. That Doom Whisperer is evading us. It would be nice to grab a Doom Whisperer. I know that's one of the sought-after cards in the set. We have yet to pull one of those. All right, we have a Gatekeeper Gargoyle. Lava Coil. Goblin Banneret. And our rare is a Gruesome Menagerie. Three and two black. Choose a creature card with converted mana cost one in your graveyard. Then do the same for creature cards with converted mana cost two and three. Return those cards to the battlefield. And we have a Boros Guildgate. And another Raw Emblem we got. We have one from the last box. Maybe we will pull a Raw. Yeah, I was at when I bought this box from my local game store. They had a, a ton of a ton of cards, a ton of common or uh, commons, a ton of singles in their case, and they were outdated for price. I helped them out, and they uh, they can get their money's worth out of their cards because they were a lot of them were really bad. Wrong. All right, True Fire Captain, City Watch Sphinx. Hellkite Whelp. And our rare is a Niv Mizzet Perun. Three blue and three red for a 5-5. Five five. This spell can't be countered. He has, uh, he's a flyer, and whenever you draw a card, Niv Mizzet Perun deals one damage to any target. Whenever a player casts an instant or sorcery spell, you draw a card. And we got a Selesnia Guildgate. And another Elf Knight. All right, we're getting down to it. Can we pull a Baraska or a Rao or even a Doom Whisperer? Let's find out. All right, an electrostatic field. Join shields. Glowspore Shaman. And our rare is a Firemind's Research. One blue and one red. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, put a charge counter on Firemind's Research. One and one blue, remove two charge counters from Firemind's Research, draw a card. Or one and one red, remove five charge counters, and it deals five damage to any target. And we got a Golgari Guildgate and another Elf Knight. No shock land so far. Almost two stacks down and not a single shock. Where are my shock lands? All right, our first uncommon is a Molder Hulk. Demir Spybug. Crawl Swarm. And our rare is a blood operative one and two black for a three one with lifelink when blood operative enters the battlefield you may exile target card from a graveyard when you surveil if blood operative blood operative is in your graveyard you may pay three life if you do return blood operative to your hand and we got a foil a foil uncommon flower and flourish Search your library for a basic forest or plains card, reveal it, put it in your hand, then shuffle your library. And creatures you control get a plus two, plus two until end of turn. Alright, our first foil of the week is a Guildgate and a Goblin Token. Didn't think I would see any of those. Jeez, all the Elf Knights and Soldiers. Alright, three packs to go. Two Mythics, one Foil Rare, and an Assassin's Trophy. Is our pull so far this box? Where are our shock lands? That's the question, guys. Are all of our shocks in the last stack? Let's keep it going and find out. All right, we have a Might of Masses. 
Sunhome Stalwart. Oh, we Dragonauts. And our rare is a Mythic. It's an Underrealm Lick. Three, one black and one green for a 4-3. If you would draw a card, instead look at the top three cards of your library. Then what? put one into your hand and the rest into your graveyard. Pay four life. Underrealm Lick gains indestructible until end of turn. Tap it. All right, so our third Mythic of the box. We're getting some Mythics now, but not necessarily the Mythics we're looking for. Demir Guildgate and a Bird Illusion. Two more to go. Are these the two? Do you have Shocklands for me? Let's crack them open. Let's get ourselves to the Uncommons. All right, we have an Undercity Necrolisk. Aff Affectionate Indrik. Goblin Banneret. And our rare is a Hatchery Spider. Oh, five and two green for a 5-7 with Reach. And a Demir Guildgate. And an Elf Knight token. Last pack of the stack. Still no Shocklands. Maybe, maybe the last stack will hold a foil Shockland for us. Wouldn't that be something? And maybe that's how they'll make it up to us. All right. We have a Necrotic Wound. Silent Dart. Glow Spore Shaman is our final uncommon. And our rare, there it is, a Temple Garden. Just as we're saying, and there we go. We got a Boros Guildgate and another Soldier Token. So today, we pulled ourselves a Temple Garden. An Underrealm Lick. Chance for Glory. And definitely our pull of the day is an Assassin's Trophy. All right, guys, that will do it. We will see you next time. Like the video if you can. Share it on social media if you can. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Instagram is RevivalMTG. Twitter is at RevivalMT. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Have a good one.